Oh, my. Hello out there. I'm Mr. Sulu of Star Trek. As far as I can remember, I've always been me. <laughs> I have to tell you that in my email, no one gets more positives than George. I totally love your smart humor on Facebook. I was the best helmsman in the galaxy and put to rest all that stereotype about Asian drivers. Aye, aye, sir, warp three. <laughs> <laughs> My father told me, look at the kind of roles that Asians are playing. And I said, Daddy, I'm going to change it. There weren't many uh, Asians on television, so when George would come on, it would be a special thing. And he was kind of a sex symbol. <laughs> <laughs> In order for me to have a viable career, I was closeted. I can't imagine what it would be like to have to hide that identity. We're a good fit because Brad is detail-oriented, but he sometimes gets a little overwhelmed. This is it's our all right. This is our house. It's, We're not filming in front of our house. He gets so nervous. My life has been transformed as fantastically as science fiction. As a boy, I looked out on the world, imprisoned behind the barbed wire fences of American internment camps. It was uh, a painful moment there. I don't believe in negativity. You determine your destiny. George is the love of my life. I'm proud of him. I've heard that before. <laughs> you know, what makes him appealing is that people feel like they have a very real connection to him. I hope he realizes what he has succeeded in doing. It's OK to be decay. <laughs> Can you open the fritos, please? Oh, my.